you're a man that's married with children and uh, you're living here in the Seattle market and you've just been served with the domestic violence restraining order and you don't know what to do. The first thing that you need to understand is that you can't violate that restraining order. Uh, if you do violate the restraining order, that's considered a criminal offense. The second thing that you need to understand is that you're going to need to work at warp speed to prepare your case for going uh, before a magistrate or a judge. Typically, there's a two-week period of time that elapses from when you're served with that restraining order to when you're actually going to be appearing in front of a, in front of a judge. So what you need to do is gather what evidence that you have that's factual and written that can contradict the statements that are made by the petitioner in the domestic violence protection order. My name is Eric Engel. I'm with the Engel Law Group. You can reach me at 206-625-9800. Thank you for watching. I wish you the best.